guys, it's Jada today, and today is our very, very, very first Christmas video of 2017. I am so excited for this video, guys. It always is kind of weird slash hard to make these Christmas wish list videos, but at the same time, like, I love watching these videos. I find them so helpful because I never ever know what I want for Christmas. So it's kind of nice to like know what everybody else wants for Christmas and then, you know, take some examples from this. So I want to say a little disclaimer before I get into this video. This is a really long list of things. These are really just some things that like I would want or could want. Whatever, I am in no way asking for all of these things for Christmas. Like, I cannot get all of these things for Christmas. But I know that these are some ideas of things that, like, I personally would want for Christmas if I could have, like, everything in the world sort of deal. So, if you're new to my channel, please subscribe down below as well as click that little notification bell to be notified every time I post a new video. And give this video a big thumbs up if you love Christmas and this is gonna be the greatest thing ever, and yes, I know Thanksgiving hasn't happened yet, but it's okay, because yeah, Christmas is great. I'm starting early this year, just like everybody else and my dad. Everyone else is already posting Christmas videos, and I was like, whoa, 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 I'm behind. So that is why I'm filming this video. I do not yet have my Christmas setup, but that will be coming soon in my next video. So with that being said, let's just get on into the video. All right, so the first thing that I would want for Christmas, and this is probably something I actually would get, is sweaters. Sweaters are a great thing to ask for Christmas because they're really only out, like at least like big thick sweaters, are really only out during Christmas time. Um, and of course there's like Black Friday, you know, which is great and you can get a lot of your Christmas presents then. Um, the second thing I'm gonna be asking for is Sephora makeup. So in general, I can go to Target or Walgreens and like afford some makeup or whatever, but I'm still a teenager and that Sephora-ish is expensive. Expansive. So a couple things like personally that I want to ask for are like the new Fenty by Rihanna foundation um, Some more eyeshadow palettes that I don't have a really great idea is like the holiday kits like holiday makeup kits or even like Sephora favorites Kits are always really good at the holiday times and just like normal like trial sizes of makeup is just a really great thing to get either a stocking stuffers or Just to try out a bunch of new products at Christmas time um, next great thing to get for Christmas is gift cards. I know this sounds really boring and lame and like it's everyone's like least favorite present to give but gift cards really are awesome because then it's like you get a gift because you know it's like to a specific store and it's like a physical card but like you can go and kind of pick out whatever you want so those are great. Number four something that I personally really want are some hiking boots. I love hiking. I love getting outside and I would love some new hiking boots to help aid in my adventurous spirit. Next thing I want is something I know a lot of YouTubers probably want, if you like edit videos, you're gonna want this, and I really want this. It's so expensive though, like I, I probably won't have it for years, but Final Cut Pro. I want Final Cut Pro so bad. Um, for my computer, it's just, oh my gosh, it's like 200 or to like $300, which is just insane. Next thing is office supplies. This makes great stocking stuffers or like small gifts for your friends, or just in general, like office supplies are freaking awesome. Like I definitely have enough at this point, but you guys know by watching my school supplies hauls that I freaking love school supplies and office supplies. So that is always something I ask for for Christmas. Next thing is like more expensive clothes, you know? So, I mean, yes, get stuff from Target and stuff like that, but like stuff from Urban Outfitters, PacSun, Brandy Melville, like all of those type of stores like that, like I never buy stuff from those stores. And if I do, it's like a rarity and like I have some dough to spend. Um, so I love to ask for that type of stuff for Christmas because I don't really get it on a normal basis. Next thing that I personally want is a leather camera strap for my DSLR. Um, there's a bunch of cute ones and like I just right now use, you know, like the normal Canon strap, but I just, I really want a leather camera strap. Next one is a new radio for Charlie and Charlie, if you guys don't know, is my Jeep Liberty. He is a 2005 Jeep Liberty. He's black. He's great. If you guys want a tar tour, let me know down below and I will be sure to film that for you guys. Um, but he has a the radio that was built in, and since he is an older car, the CD player doesn't work, there's not an aux cord, like, it has a lot of trouble connecting to the stations, like, it's kind of rough. And, like, aftermarket radios, if you get, like, a decent, like, they're not, they're not that expensive, which is good, and so that is definitely something that me personally wants for my car. This one is Polaroid film. I have a Polaroid, and I haven't had film for it for, like, months, so that is definitely something I am asking for for Christmas. SD cards. Literally, as a photographer, slash YouTuber, slash filmmaker, slash everything I do with these cameras, 
I need SD cards. Literally telling my mom, fill up my stocking with extra Camry batteries and SD cards because literally that is all I need. Another thing that I'm probably not gonna get, but I would love is some new lenses for my camera. One specifically that I want is the Canon 50mm 1.4 lens, as well as the Sigma 30mm 1.4 lens. The Sigma lens is really expensive. Um, and so is the other one, and I know I probably won't get either of these, but it is definitely something that I just like fawn over every time I see it in the store. Next thing would be some nice headphones for editing. I've always wanted Beats or um, like any other really nice headphones. I probably won't get those, they're kind of expensive and it's kind of just feels so excess to me to spend that much money on like headphones. But like I said, this video is just me blurting out anything I could ever possibly want for Christmas this year to give you guys some more ideas. So if you're into music or videos or whatever, like Beats, that's a great thing. And also, tip for that, if this video doesn't go up before Black Friday, I'm really sorry, but if it does go up before Black Friday, go to Best Buy Black Friday, they will definitely have some deals on some Beats. Next one is a cute beanie for those insta pics. Next one is like a warm coat, like not just like a cute coat, that's it, that's later on in the list, but um, like an actual warm coat. One specifically that I want, there's like a North Face jacket, it's white and it's like that thin bubble jacket, you know, but not like a bubble jacket, but like you know, like the thinner down jackets. One of those I've always wanted, probably again won't get, but... I do really like them, they're so cute. Next one specifically for me is Apple Watch bands because as you guys know by my last, or second to last video, I don't know. I just recently got an Apple Watch and I am in love with it and that also adds, I guess I could go ahead and add this in if you don't have an Apple Watch, that's a great thing to ask for for Christmas. And like tell your parents, because I know they are really expensive new, that like you don't need to get a new one. I bought mine used. Um, and so tell your parents like it's okay if they want to buy you a used one, you know, that'll make it a lot more cost effective for your mom and dad, you know, you gotta, you gotta think about them sometimes. Next one is knit socks. I have a lot of fuzzy socks, but I want knit socks because they look cute with boots. You can wear like socks with Birkenstocks with them and they're just really cozy and warm. And you know, socks, even though that seemed like a crappy present when I was like 10, is now actually like the best thing ever. Leggings, leggings, and more leggings. Literally leggings is what I wear on a daily basis. Like I'm wearing them right now um, to school and you know, you can never have too many. I mean, right? Uh, cute water bottles slash like nicer water bottles like for me personally my favorite water bottles in the whole wide world are hydro flasks so if you haven't got one of those I would definitely ask for one for Christmas they will literally keep your water cold for days I put ice cubes in water in a hydro flask and left it in a hot car on accident and came back three days later and there were still little pieces of ice in it like that is how great that thing is so uh, I recommend those other options are swell water bottles or Corsicle water bottles um you know the basics. Next thing I personally am going to be looking for, I don't exactly know like what specific ones I want, but some cute Nike tennis shoes. I am all about the sneakers, okay? I got Adidas Superstars, I have some like gray, like the knit Nikes, and like I, that is like what I wear on like an everyday basis, really, like that's just kind of my style, I like the shoes. Um, so. Another pair of cute tennis shoes is always a great thing to ask for for Christmas. Next one is Vans. I'm still iffy on Vans, like the slide on Vans is what I'm talking about. Um, because they're so cute and like I've always wanted want some, but like, I don't know yet, but that's just, it's up there, it's up there. Room decor, everybody loves room decor, room decor, room decor, room decor, all right? My room, as you guys can see by my room tour is uh, pretty full of room decorations at this point, but you know, if I find something cute between now and Christmas, like, I'd love that as a Christmas present. Next one is planner accessories. As you can see by my last video, um, I actually just got the personal planner planner that I am loving right now, so I would always love some more like stickers and books and tabs and whatever for planners. You know, that that's fun. Planners are great. And since it's starting a new year, it would also be really cool to ask for a planner to start the new year. Next thing I personally really need, but like, isn't really a gift idea for everybody else is my studio lights. I have two softbox lights and I feel like their light bulbs are getting kind of dim. So I need replacement light bulbs for them, pretty much. So it's not really that interesting, but you know. You guys wanted to know what I was asking for. Next thing I would say is books. Obviously, don't get books for someone who doesn't like books. And me, myself, like, I kind of go back and forth on reading. I hate reading for school. Like, literally, I despise it and I just rant about it all the time. But on the other hand, 
I love to go to Barnes & Noble and find a good book and just sit down on a Saturday outside in my Eno and read books and it's great. So if I get to pick the book, I love reading. If I it's a school book, it just makes me despise it. Even if it's a good book, I despise it. Next thing, again, this is kind of embarrassing, but again, it's kind of specific to me, is Harry Potter stuff. As you guys know, I have a little bit of collection of Harry Potter things. I have a Harry Potter collection haul thing, whatever, on this channel as well. If you guys want to check that out, I'll put it in the cards up here. Um, but, so, you know, I could always use some more pop figures or replicas and books and stuff like that. I'm sorry, it's it's kind of weird and nerdy, but I love Harry Potter, so don't judge me. Next one, everyone's least favorite present to give, and like probably the most like boring packaging-wise, money! Money, money, money! Like literally everyone loves money, and even if it's kind of a boring gift to give, if you have no ideas, just give them some money. And if you want to like snazzy it up or whatever, like hide a $20 bill in a toilet paper roll, um, and then put it in like a jar or a bucket or something and then fill candy around it so that they don't see it and then like when they eat all the candy they'll see the money sort of deal like make something cute if you don't really want to just give someone like straight dough so those are all the things basically that like I will probably be asking for for Christmas most of the stuff I'm getting for Christmas is probably just gonna be like clothes or like camera accessories or like stationery and stuff like that all right guys that's gonna be it for today's video if you liked it please give it a big thumbs up as well as comment down below any other video ideas you guys have for this holiday season or just for my channel in general um, if you're new here please subscribe to my channel that would be great and turn on those little notification bells so that you are notified whenever I post a new video which is like a lot kind of I don't know why I'm doing this let's just stop I also have another question for you guys I've been getting a little bit of PR sent to me in the mail not like a ton like these huge beauty gurus do but I do get a fair little bit of some so if you guys would like to see a video kind of dedicated to like PR that small youtubers get or whatever or like how to get PR as a small youtuber like like a PR haul pretty much is what I'm asking um, let me know in the comment section down below if that's something you guys would like to see. Thank you so much for watching this video, and I will see you guys next week with another video, or maybe in a couple of days, because it's my Thanksgiving break, and I have a lot of time to film videos.